morning guys i still wanted to do a first impressions on the new chanel les beiges which i have failed to do this morning because the lighting in my house this morning was really bad so i didn't really film the part where i put the foundation on but i still wanted to go ahead and do a video for you and show you guys just the first impressions of what i thought on the chanel uh, les, les beiges foundation which is a new foundation chanel has launched and i've got it actually on today and i really really like it um but i'm going to do some check-ins throughout the day and just tell you guys and update you guys how it um feels but i've got a by terry don sleeve primer underneath like i usually do and i just got a light layer of um the chanel foundation and some concealer and the rest of my makeup then so it's now let's have a look do a time check i think it's 10 25 at the moment i'm going to get my hair colored and cut today and i will check back with you in the next couple of hours and yeah i will let you guys know how i get on with the foundation as well so i'll see you guys in a bit Hey everyone, it's only me checking in with you guys now. It's about 1.13 in the afternoon and I had my foundation on since about 10 o'clock this morning. And so far, I don't think I need to touch up yet. I see a slight shine, but it's not too um, oily at the moment, so I don't really need to touch up. But other than that, I feel like the foundation has worn quite well on the skin. It still feels really light and I had have had my hair blow dried and washed um as well and it hasn't really affected the makeup as well so other than that i haven't got really much to report back on but so far the foundation feels really light and it's still on my skin as well so i'll check back with you in later on um in the next couple of hours as well so see you guys in a bit hey everyone so it's about six o'clock now and i'm just coming back to do a um maybe one before last um foundation update um i have had my foundation on since about 10 o'clock this morning and i haven't had the need to touch up yet although i probably should powder up by now but overall i feel like this foundation has worn quite well i don't feel the need to um run to get powder or run to blot um my natural oils are starting to come through um which is quite natural but for the wear of the foundation i think in general is pretty good so i have had like i said this foundation on since about 10 o'clock and yeah it's a really really nice foundation it feels really comfortable on the skin and it hasn't oxidized to a like darker color as well but i will do a last final update before when i get home before i take it all off and i'll um, let you know my um verdict towards the end as well so definitely stay tuned for the last one and i'll see you guys in a bit Hey everyone, I'm doing my last check-in now. It's 20 past eight and I'm ready to take my makeup off. I'm actually only just got home, so I'm ready to take all my makeup off. But overall, I have to say my final verdict is I love this foundation. I haven't actually touched up all day if you guys can see. My natural oils have started to seep through like down the T-zone as it usually would. And I do need to blot. If I was to leave this foundation on for a bit longer, I would have to blot and powder. But overall, I feel like this foundation um, definitely wears really well. And I have had it on since about 10 o'clock this morning. And it hasn't really budged or oxidized in color. And it looks exactly the same as it did this morning. So overall, really, really impressed with this foundation. And yeah, um, my natural oils have started to come through, um, but other than that, it still looks exactly the same. It hasn't faded or anything, which I'm really, really impressed. And my overall verdict is, yes, I totally recommend this foundation, and it's definitely a great one to try out if you are after a good wear long wearing foundation as well. So this is the Chanel Les Beiges foundation, and I got the shade in B20, and that's it for me from my first impressions video i hope you all enjoyed this video and if you did like usual give it a huge thumbs up and thanks for following me around and i hope you all enjoyed this first impressions video thanks for watching bye